Hello, 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 and welcome to episode 8 of the Pokemon Black Random Nuzlocke Challenge Genlocked to the Innova region, which is the upcoming region in Pokemon Go. Uh, we're down to, well, we're back up to two Mons now. We've got Lady Vox, our Kyruum, and we got our Trevor, who's a trash bag. Apparently that's a legitimate Pokemon type these days. Uh, let's see if we can heal up Trevor and get him a fight. Super Potion, use one of actually no, we won't use a Super Potion, we'll use a normal potion. Save the Supers for when we actually need it. Go, good man. Uh, actually, I will give a couple to Box whilst we're here. There we go. Team's looking healthy. We are in the middle of a garden maze. Let's get the map out and see what it's actually called. Did have a proper name. There we go. We're in Pinwheel Forest. Okay. Let's see. Not straight into an encounter. Okay. Wild Damatirian. Okay. Exerting pressure. Gonna fight and let's use an ancient power. There we go. Super effective one hit kill. Thank you very much. Okay. She's getting on quite nicely. Let's see if we can bag. There's our lucky uh I think we already gave it to uh, uh, Trevor, so let's uh, switch him out. Let's see if we can get him a little bit of experience. Wild Blitzel, level 13. Switch back into box XP. She's high enough level now that she should be all right with uh, these random encounters. Using charge. Hopefully, we should be able to get our shot off before uh, gets any more. It's ancient power saying. critical hit. See ya! Trevor's getting a nice chunk of XP there. Come on. Where's my encounters? Fighting you, mate. Shift Fox out. I'm starting to get low on PP for me, so I probably should try and finish this and get back to Poke Center before we do any more leveling up. Oh, roll out, that's not going to be nice. Okay. Let's finish him off with Ancient Power. Waboosh! Super effective. See you later, son. Trevor got level 14. Nice. Should a move be deleted to replace with double slap? Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, realistically, I'm never going to use recycle, so we'll forget that. Trevor's 
Try to land double slap. Good stuff. Okay. Alright. Switch box back in. Okay. Let's see if we can. Yeah, we've got a couple of trainers to fight here. I test the challenge rock with my fist every day. It's important to make steady progress little by little. That's the second person who's mentioned this challenge rock. I'd be interested to see uh, what exactly that is. Uh, uh, Rich Girl Pansy sent out a sesame toad. Yeah. Right, well. Let's not mess around with this guy. Dragon Rage. He looks a bit tasty. I only got him to half. It's reduced our speed, which means he's probably going to get another go. Uh, let's try Ice Beam, just so we know for the future if it's worth using on him. Oh, we! That was lovely. Nice chunk of XP there. You did not train hard enough. Not at all. Okay. So we've got that little guy up here. Uh, let's see what he's saying. I trained and trained like a madman and my Pokemon trained even more. Trained like a madman, did you? Okay. Cyclist Florentino. I don't think that uh, karate belt's uh, conducive to uh, safe cycling. It's going to get ca caught up in a chain and stuff. That is not what it's about. It's an accident waiting to happen. Let's see how he likes an ice beam. Not at all. Timber indeed. Even though I lost, I'm energetic. Great. What's that matter? I assume this is the challenge rock that everyone keeps talking about. It's a challenge rock. <laughs> Good to know. I was expecting slightly more, but okay. We've got a Reaper Cloth. Okay, what's a Reaper Cloth on its own? Back. Reaper Cloth. A cloth imbued with horrifyingly strong spiritual energy. It is loved by a certain Pokemon. Okay. The odds that it's going to be the Trash Man or uh, Lady Vox is very, very uh, minimal, I think. Have we already fought this dude? Yeah, I think this is where we came in. Uh, team Plasma are up to something. They're blocking the way. Check that out later. I'll show my my uh, inputs on the screen again. Sorry about that. Let's get rid of that. Um, do, 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 do. Let's the display. See you later. There we go. Right. How did we get to that bit? I must have missed it. Ah, there we go. Leon found an ever. That could be very useful given uh, Lady Vox's minimal PP on all of her moves. Okay. Right, we're back to town. Now we explored some of this town, including this Poke uh, Center, which we're going to now. But we didn't explore all of it. I haven't got any dead Pokemon with me, it's just these two, isn't it? Yeah, okay, let's go heal them up. Is that a trusty Pokemon? Yeah, why not? Oh, I completely missed doing the uh, song that time. 
Thank you for waiting. Full health. Good stuff. Uh, anything exciting at the shop? Uh, buy some more super potions. You can never have enough of them. Uh, how many great balls have we got? Two. We can only afford to buy two as well. Uh, is there anything we can sell maybe? What have we got to sell? Which is that Reaper Cup work? A thousand. Maybe Amulet Coin. Powers up the power of steel type moves. Keep up the time being. Poison gem because you can only use it once. Let's get rid of that. Uh, and the same for the fire gem. Stealth stripe set to be held by gen. Oh yeah, what's the chance that we're going to get a gen sect? Get rid of that. Okay. Please come again. Is that enough to buy another? Great ball, yeah. Yes. Okay. And then get out of that. Okay, cookies. So let's explore the top of this tank because we didn't do that last time. We've been in that restaurant. Did that bit. Ah. We got our next pokey gym here. I won't go quite there yet. Yeah, I've spoken to her and done those buildings, so... Uh, just this building left by the looks of it. That's a double. I am a poet. I write poems. Every day I stretch my imagination and devote myself to my creative activity. People dream when sleeping, but if a Pokemon dreams, I cannot even imagine how it is. Just need to speak to the Snorlax. They do nothing but dream. Even the same kind of Pokemon can have different natures. Great. Cheers for that. Oh, what's the song this guy playing? I play the guitar and have Pokemon battles every day. I keep doing that because I enjoy it. That's good to know. And it doesn't look like we can go into the next door. So got the gym there. Our Kyrium is definitely uh, a strong enough level for it, I think. Yeah. Oh! Apparently, we're not going to go for the gym. I want to see things no one can see. The ideals of Pokemon inside Pokeballs. The truth of how trainers should be. And a future where Pokemon have become perfect. That's a question? Go no? Huh. I expected more from you. Now pay attention. My friends and I will test you to see if you can see this future too. Okay, looks like we're having a fight. Not the gym battle I was hoping for. It's got three mons. Okay. Rana. Level 13 now is a fire ghost typing. So. That's just Dragon Rage. That should be uh, plenty effective. Oh, didn't quite get him. But got enough. That we should be able to. Uh, I have to use another Dragon Rage, unfortunately, because I don't think Cut is a uh, nailed on with it being a ghost typing. Ah, level 23. Here we go. He's sending in Shelmet. And I will keep battling. Okay. Right. Let's 
give an ice cream to Shelmet. Yeah, one hit kill. See you later, son. Okay. Uh, Panseer. Keep that then. Okay, uh. Taking over the bottom cup's probably going to be enough, you know. Unless he's got a advantage to it, but he doesn't. I cannot see the future. There's still a world to be determined. Something, something. Right now, my friends aren't strong enough to save all Pokemon. Maybe I can't solve the equation that will change the world. So I need power. Power enough to make anyone agree with me. Now I know the power I need, Zekrom. The legendary Pokemon that along with the hero created the Innova region. Well, if you're looking for a Zekrom there, we're wild on uh, Route 1 at the moment, mate. It's my turn to become that hero and you and I will be friends. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be friends, pal. Oh, that voice really hurts my throat. Hopefully he's not going to have too much dialogue in this game. So my issue here is that Fox is high enough level, but I don't think Trevor is. But let's see what happens with him front and centre. Here we go, Gym 2. What's this lady got to say for herself? Welcome to the Nacrenia Museum. Alright, so the first gym's a restaurant, second is a museum. You can get to the Pokemon Gym by going to the back of the museum. Good to know. I am researching Pokemon fossils here. If you have a fossil, bring it to me. If I did, I would. Wow! Whenever I look at this skeleton, I'm fascinated. Welcome, I'm Hawes, the <laughs> Assistant Director. That's an unfortunate name there, Hawes. Since you're kind enough to visit, I'll give you a guided tour of the museum. Well, didn't really want that. This skeleton is of a dragon type Pokemon. Is it a Dragonite? There's a theory that it had an accident when it was flying around the world and it and so it became a fossil. This rock is amazing, it's a meteorite. It contains some kind of energy from space. Oh this, it's an ordinary old stone, I bet it's not. It was found near the desert, but other than the fact it's old, it doesn't seem to have any value. We only display it because it's rather pretty to look at. The Pokemon Gym is just beyond here. At the end of the gym, a very strong and kind gym leader is waiting. By the way, the gym leader, Lorona, happens to be my wife. Oh, I'm sorry I butchered her name so badly. What's this chick saying? The gym leader here studies fossils and ancient artifacts. Is there anything else in there? Speak to all the people. Rare Pokemon from around the world, museums are packed with adventure. Mm. What's this old guy got to say for himself? Perhaps there's a Pokemon that came from space along with this meteorite. Maybe. Alright, let's go for it. Alright. There's our mate again. A Pokemon gym where a leader waits for a challenger at the back of the museum. It has a great atmosphere, doesn't it? So I'll give this to you. Another fresh water. We're getting lots of those. All trainers in this gym use normal type Pokemon. This is just between you and me. Normal type or weak against fighting type Pokemon. Yeah, well that's not going to be the case here. Now for your information, first book is nice to meet you Pokemon. If you don't know where the book is, please ask anyone. Here we go, fight one. I hang around Dakar in the gym all, day, all the time. People call me a bookworm. I warn you now, I'm strong because I spend the entire day either reading books or training Pokemon. I'm not sure how reading books is going to improve your strength, but... Let's see. Manager Alex sent out Mandibuzz. Okay, bird type. Level 17, so... Trevor will get a bit of XP, but he's certainly not taking part in the fight. Shift out into box. 
and take whatever he throws at us and respond with an ancient power. That's got to be the plan. Uh, apologies if you can hear my dog barking there. Postman's just gone past. Okay. Fire ancient power. See ya, son. Oof. Nasty plot. Okay. What's that going to do? Special attack rose sharply. Doesn't matter, we're going to finish off with a cut to save our PP. And he's down. Trevor got 817, that's what we're talking about. Level 15. I may be a bookworm, but I'm not bad at Pokemon. I assume is what that said. <laughs> the text uh, moves uh, too fast sometimes. Okay. Let's, uh, my first recommendation is a book called Nice to Meet You Pokemon. The bookshelves for children's books are close to the entrance. This is a bookshelf for children's books. Nice to meet you Pokemon. Do you want to read this book? Yeah. It's a fairy tale about a little boy who met a Pokemon for the first time in his life. He is with a small brown Pokemon. There's a memo between the pages. Pokemon trainers, I am the gym leader Lenora. I had four memos in this library. Each of them has a question. Can you solve the questions and come find me? Now this is the first question. What is the first Pokemon you met in this gym? The hint is on a bookshelf in the middle row. Now try and find it. Okay. No. So we need to read the two books here. I bet it's going to be on the one where she's in the way of, but we'll check this one in case. Biology of Patrat. Sure. They communicate with each other by moving the tail to Patrat raises its tail when it sees an enemy. There's a memo on the back of the cover. As I thought, that question was easy. Well, this is the second question. Flame burns inside its body and it gives off smoke from its head while it runs. What is this book? The hint is somebody may be reading it. Well, it's going to be this chick here, isn't it? You found a second memo and you're looking for a book? What does the memo say? Flame burns inside its body and it gives off the smoke from its head while it runs. I'm reading a book about Tepig, but is this book the correct answer? Yes? Teehee, what a picky. This book about Tepig says it gives off flame from its nostril. When it's not well, it can give off only smoke. Slightly from different from give us smoke when it heads while it runs. The answer is in memo no, not be a living thing. T he. Okay. So it's not her. I assume it's this guy. Hmm, I see. You found the memo came to look for this book. What did the memo say? Blah blah blah, yeah. I'm reading a book called The Structure of a Locomotive. It wasn't a Pokemon at all. And it gives us smoke from the head while it runs. That's exactly how a locomotive looks. Well, I'll let you read this book. But before that, it'd be great for my research if we had a Pokemon battle. Yay! Hopefully it'll be something trash bag can have a go at. Let's see. Cool trainer Kimberly sent out Litwick. Okay, in fact, looks like it's a ghost. Uh, I... going to work out for us. Looks like it's going to be Ladybox again. Okay. Oh, I should use the next defend. That works for me. Uh, let's try Ice Beam just because it's uh, got more PP. Not very effective. Do me. Do me all day. I've never known anyone so powerful. I wish I could say you're not the first person saying that, but that's not true. Return a book to a shelf after reading, that's a rule when you read the book. Okay. Uh, blah, blah, 
blah. It's impressive you found this place. That's what I'd expect from Chandra like you. Well, this is the third question. If you heat it up in a pot, it'll be delicious. What is this? The hint is on the bookshelf closer to the entrance than here. Okay. Well, there's only two shells we've not read. This one. Sweets of Pokemon. It's got delicious sweets made by heating berries in a pot. There we go. There are sweets called Poffins, made from berries in the faraway Sinnoh region, and Pokemon love them. I think that's Pokemon Gold and Silver. Did you manage to get here without being tricked by the questions? Now this is the last question. From this bookshelf, move two backwards and one to the left. Move two forwards, move one to the right. right so two backwards, one, two, one to the left, one to the right, two forwards, brings us back here. I move one backwards. Now where is it? The hint is find it by yourself. Two backwards, so that'll be one, two, one left, two forwards, one, two, one to the right. Hmm. Can't be out of the gym, surely. No. Although one thing we will do, as we get into the gym leader, we'll switch Trevor and Box around, just in case we get surprised by something really nasty. Uh, From this bookshelf, move two backwards, move one to the left, move two forward, move one to the right, so they counteract each other, move one backward, right. must just be this one then. I'm wondering, did you see the last member and come to see me? Okay, I'll give you the last question. Can you challenge the gym leader if you win against me? Yes. To hear that is correct. Well, here we go, trainer. Okay. Pig night. Okay. and typing so I'm gonna go with cut and hope that he can't one hit kill me. Flame charge is obviously a fire type. And it's speed rose so he might get another shot off but this cut should finish him off anyway. Okay. Nice bit of XP. Fungus. Now we'll keep paddling. What's Fungus about? That is a mushroom. Let's freeze the mushroom. Ice beam. In a bit. Super effective. One hit KO. It's about to send in Sork. Oh, we'll keep battling. That sounds like it's going to be a bird type. Okay, no. He looks like he's fighting in something. Uh, we'll try Ice Beam. Sort of painted. That will do us. Manager Joe defeated. Thanks for a great battle. No, thank you. You'll meet the gym leader soon. This is the last book. Now read the last book. This is on the Pokemon shelf for Pokemon. The Biology of Tepig. Yeah, we'll read it. Biology of Tepig. Give off any smoke. There's a moment between the pages. You managed to get here well done. You seem to have wisdom as well as strength. I look forward to our battle. Gym leader Lenora. Click. There's a switch under the book. Hey, hey, hey. And I 
assume that's going to take us to the gym leader. A hidden staircase. Alright. And for those of you watching on YouTube, that will have to wait for tomorrow's episode. Thank you very much for watching and come back tomorrow. And...